Next up, Jodie Foster um, is talking mad spicy about superhero films. <laughs> um, she says that uh, I feel like I make movies because there are things I have to say in order to figure out who I am or my place in the world or for me to evolve as a person. However, she says going in the movies has become like a theme park. What does that mean? Just uh, studios that- making bad content in order to appeal to the masses and shareholders um, is like fracking. You get the best return right now, but you wreck the earth. Hmm. I'm going to need you to calm the fuck down well, because it's- you were in Elysium. <laughs> Yo, that movie is garbage. Um, two, superhero movies do have things to say. Captain America had a thing to say. Captain America Winter Soldier was talking about surveillance. Um, Civil War had a lot to do with, well, one, I mean, that, that was more of a, just a general Avengers movie, but it also dealt personal with, like, the death of parents and things like that. Like, those movies do have a lot to say. Maybe you don't know that because you don't actually see them. That's yeah, that's the impression super, I get. She sees comics and um, some, some comics. Yeah, like I, I think that is incredibly obvious. Like she doesn't actually watch them. Also, if Marvel called and was like, "Hey, Jodie Foster, you want to be in this movie?" You think Jodie Foster's turning it down? I think she would. She better. You, well, better now, now she now. would. She, <laughs> she ain't got she, no fucking choice. Yeah, now she would. Look, you better than Robert Redford. You better than Robert Redford. <laughs> no, you're not. Robert Redford was in one of these movies. Get out of here. Better than Glenn Close. Come on, man. Yeah. I think they might eat. I think Marvel is so big now. I think they could get Meryl Streep. I really do. I think Meryl Streep would do it. She'd be like, who do I Probably. get to play? You Probably. know what? Fuck it. What's, Meryl, uh, Streep for, Meryl Streep for Spider-Man. Fuck it. She'll be amazing. <laughs> she can do anything. What was uh, what's her name? This isn't a comic book movie. It might as well be a comic book movie. Helen Mirren. You better than Helen Mirren. She, she was, was in a Fast, fast and fast. Furious movie. No, Helen Mirren wasn't a comic book movie. She was in Red. Those are comics. Well, there you go. Those movies are fucking trash, though. I mean, in fairness <laughs> to you, Jody Foster, you're right. Um, but yeah, she was in the Fast and Furious movies. Like she wanted to be in the Fast yeah, she Furious. called. Like, Yo, I want to be. How, it's, how it's, can I be down? Yeah, like it's Dame Mirren. Remember that picture I took with Idris Elba? Like, I love black dudes. Can I be in this movie? There's like a lot of colored folk in here. I just want to be. I want to be cool. Um, yeah, like there's been plenty. There's been plenty of major actors who have been in these movies. Like. Yeah, they enjoy it. It's okay to have movies that are fun. By the way, all those independent movies that you love and all this other stuff, I also love them. I'm not going to shit on them, you know, just because you said this. But at the same time, who do you think funds those movies? Yeah, I was about to say, like, the <laughs> the, the <laughs> summer movie season is uh, what the movie studios rely on to make it through the movies that, you know, more people should see but nobody wants to see. Yeah, sorry. And Micah honestly, talked about Lady Bird. Guess what? I'm sure Lady Bird got funded by someone shooting a laser through a wall. At some point. <laughs> and honestly, I don't need to see those movies in the theater. Like, those are not movie-going experiences for me. Right. I, like, I look, would rather watch them in the house. Yeah, so I can hear dialogue and shit like that. I go to the theater to see Iron Man punch someone through a wall. That's why <laughs> or I'm get, here. Or, get, or watch Iron Man get concussed. Well, that is also. <laughs> God, I can't wait for that. Pretty sure that's Pepper in that suit. <laughs> so he's going to punch a woman to death in this movie. That's amazing. That feels problematic, I feel like. But that's fine. I'm okay with that. Because um, if anybody needs to get punched to death, it's the goop. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, <laughs> like, I need that to be the sound, the sound effect of Thanos hitting that Iron Man suit, if it is Pepper. Just goop. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? That's fine. <laughs> I wanted to be on the cover of her fucking magazine. <laughs> this is the time I got knocked the fuck out by Josh Brolin. Just a big comic automatopoeia. Just goop. <laughs> on the cover me. of that magazine. That is fine by me. Oh. 